Good morning, you guys. It is Monday morning. I'm starting off the vlog today on Monday. I'm gonna sit you guys down for a sec. I have kind of a lot going on this week and I feel like it's like a little more on the exciting side. So I was like, let me vlog for them. I got up at like around seven in the morning, like 7.30 a.m. this morning. And I don't know, my coffee like hasn't kicked in yet, but I, kind of put some like loose curls in my hair. Oh, I don't even think I told you what I'm doing today. Sorry, I'm so like ADHD. I'm going to the Pretty Little Thing showroom today. They're doing a denim day for influencers. So I'm going to be going in. I'm really excited. I'm not really sure exactly what that means. I feel like that means we're gonna be like decorating denim or something. I don't know, I'm really excited though. I'm gonna finish getting ready and then I will see you guys in a little bit. Okay guys, so I just got to Pretty Little Thing. I literally keep forgetting to vlog, but I'm outside and I wanna show you guys what it looks like. There's like a DJ and it's literally so cute, but I'm about to go inside. Look, literally look how cute. They have like a little taco truck. And then I ended up wearing this pink dress, nude heels, and then this little nude purse. But yeah, I'm gonna go inside now. But yeah, now I'm just gonna wait for my Uber to come. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is so hilarious. They're so big, I feel so extra. So I am now back at home. I'm so sorry that I didn't get that much of like footage in there. Just because I'm still getting used to like vlogging in public and I couldn't really like talk, but I got a few clips. So I'll have that. Yeah, I hope that was enough for you guys. I'll try to include more next time if i go next time i'm just getting better and better at vlogging so this is like the current mess i just finished doing it. like a little haul of like what i got so if you guys want to see that you should go over to my tiktok i have my tiktok down below it's just at angela dentoni same as my instagram but yeah i had a lot of fun it was so fun i was a little like kind of nervous because i was showing up alone but it ended up going great it was very fun so grateful thank you pretty little thing for inviting me i'm so happy and blessed ew i sound so fake but i really am so happy and i feel so blessed so thank you i think i was gonna post like a more chill photo but then i took some photos at pretty little thing today and i was like hmm, should i just post one of those i can't really decide i'm gonna go get food and regroup i will check back in with you guys in a little hi guys my makeup is still done i really like the way my makeup came out today. I didn't put lashes on. I just did mascara. And then when I went to the event, they put like lashes on me and they were so, so cute. They're like half lashes. They're kind of falling off now, but they're so cute. I'm thinking it looks so pretty, but oh, I'm literally so tired. I was so tired. I like just want to like go to sleep but i'm actually sleeping over at my boyfriend's house tonight just because well one i want to see him and then two i have a shoot tomorrow and it's like on the other side of town and it would just make more sense for me to spend the night over there because it's like closer to his house than it is my house so yeah i'm just gonna do that so then you just go straight there tomorrow so i just have to pack my bags my shoot i'm so excited you guys i'm doing a shoot with truly beauty for their tiktok and they needed a model with acne prone skin so that is what i'm doing i'm so excited but yeah they told me to wear solid colors so i'm gonna pack my bag in a little bit i'm just like waiting because honestly like i'm just really tired so i'm just like laying down like 
resting. I don't think I'll check back in tonight. I think I'm just going to vlog again tomorrow morning. So now, yeah, I'm just going to go to my boyfriend's house in a little bit. But anyways, first I'm going to like rest a little. Um, but yeah, I will see you guys tomorrow morning. Use my pimple patches. I have two little stars. I just got back from my shoot. I'm so sorry I did not vlog while I was there. It was honestly very like fast and we were getting everything, like all the shots done like really, really fast. So I didn't really have time to like set up my camera. It was like back to back to back shots. But yeah, so I was shooting with Truly Beauty. I'm not doing anything the rest of the day. So I was like, might as well just put these on. And I had press on nails, but they literally popped off. So I look a mess right now. But yeah, this morning was super hectic because I slept over at my boyfriend's house. And then I forgot my house keys at his house. And it was just such a mess this morning. I was like, of course, like I would forget my house keys and I'm already on the way to the shoot. Yeah, the shoot went really well. The girls were super, super sweet. Amazing. You guys should go follow Truly Beauty on their social media. I will be on their TikTok very soon. comment down below if you eat with chopsticks if you can eat with chopsticks or if you eat with a fork the only reason i know how to eat with chopsticks is because my grandpa taught me when i was really little for my birthdays he would always take me to benihana's it's like a japanese um like where they cook in front of you on the hibachi and like they do like the show or whatever he would take me to those he taught me like how to like hold it and like at that restaurant, they would give you like some practice ones. They would like give you, I don't even know what it was. I think it was a napkin with a rubber band. All you had to do was like push down. And it was like for people who are learning how to use chopsticks. Anyways, but yeah, my grandpa would like taught me and then he got me like some of those. And I was just a pro after basically. Just kidding. That's where like I learned. I see people eat chopsticks with rice and I'm like, oh, how do you get like enough rice on here? that like you know what i'm saying like when people get like scoops of rice and they eat like chopsticks with rice i like want to get to that point where i can do that but like it's like not enough rice to satisfy me like at a time i could only get like two pieces <laughs> anyways back to my food so i'm about to get my lips blushed this is the before, so it just looks like this. I got lip fillers like maybe three weeks ago, two weeks ago. I don't even remember now, but I'm like a little bit nervous because this is something I've been wanting to do for a really long time, but I've never found a place. <laughs> and also it's expensive. The procedure is like $500 and up. But anyways, I'm going to be doing it today. I'm so excited and I will show you guys the immediate after results later and this is just for my vlog but i am going to be doing an in-depth entire video about my experience and everything while i'm here so it's a little bit later in the day it's 9 p.m now so it's way later on i actually wasn't feeling the best earlier today i like hadn't eaten and i was just like laying down with the bright lights getting my lips blushed and that just like all of that just like ended up giving me like a migraine after yeah basically this is like how they look now i love 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 the shape i love the way that she like carved it out it looks so good they look really intense obviously right now but there's like it's a process so they're gonna get like better but i'm really happy 
and I'll keep updating you guys. Like I said, I just did that and then I came home because I had a migraine and I just like chilled. And then I also did my taxes, which is adult things. So that was good and pretty late, but better late than never. So I'm happy I did that. And then tomorrow I'm finally, finally getting my hair done. I'm so excited. I've literally waited so long and I'm just like genuinely so excited. It is the second day and I'm going to show you guys the progress on my lips. So this is what they're looking like. Let me show you closer. But no, today they feel fine and I'm actually liking it because it's like starting to like tone down a little bit. Because it was so intense at first it looked like I had bright red lipstick on. But yeah, the bottom one is like really peeling off. So I'm really happy about that. So I will keep you guys updated as the days go on. So here is the final look at my lips. I think they look so, so good. I'm obsessed with the color. And then on Friday night, I went to this restaurant called The Little Door with my boyfriend. We both had the sea bass and the mashed potatoes and it was so amazing, you guys. If you're in the LA area, I definitely, definitely recommend you go. The vibes are just amazing. And there's my boyfriend, so cute. I forgot to close out the video and I have like a million pimple patches on. But yeah, subscribe. I love you guys. I'll see you guys next week.